Alfa Romeo started under the name of Societa Anonima Italiana Derek back in 1906. In 1910 it was acquired by businessman Nicola Romeo. Alfa then produced a 4.1-liter four-cylinder car, the 1910-24 HP, its first-ever car. Then started a whole series of some of the unparalleled vehicles like Torpedo 20-30 HP, Alfa Grand Prix, Alfa Romeo 20-30 S Sport, and Alfa Romeo RL. Models like Savacci's Four Leaf Clover, Grand Premio Tipo P2, Alfa Romeo P3 Monoposto, Alfa Romeo 158, 159 Alfetta, and later the mass-produced model Alfa Romeo Spider are considered masterpieces even today. The Alfa Grand Prix took its wheels to some of the crucial Italian races in the 1920s, including the Mugello Circuit, Brescia Circuit, and Parma Bersito. Further, a time came when Ferrari and Alfa Romeo collaborated and created Alfa Romeo by Motor, Scuderia Ferrari, a twin-engined race car. Models like the Alfa Romeo 8C2900 and 8C2900B were made both as racers and coach-built road cars. In 1950 Alfa made a clean sweep winning six out of six Grand Prix races, and won the inaugural Formula One championship of drivers with Giuseppe Farina, Juan Manuel Fangio, and Luigi Fagioli. In the late 60s and early 70s Alfa had great success with their Giulia GTA and GTAM. It racked up a series of wins for Auto Delta, Alfa S Racing Works. In 1986, Fiat acquired Alfa, which had been run by the Italian government since 1928. Since 2021 it is the Stellantis consortium that owns Alfa Romeo. Being an old company, Alfa Romeo went through the havoc of World War I and II, and financial ups and downs. But every year, it shaped some sensational cars until reaching the latest models, like Alfa Romeo Stelvio, Alfa Romeo Giulia, Stelvio Quadrifoglio, Giulia Quadrifoglio, and Tenale.